For instance, some fans want GTA 6 to have vehicle physics just like Beam NG. Now, if you've ever played that game, you know how insanely realistic and crazy those car crashes are. I mean, I absolutely love watching my car crumple into a twisted wreck of metal, but come on, let's be real here. Wanting that in GTA 6 would be a total nightmare, for a variety of different reasons. Every time you accidentally bump into a pole or hit another car, your vehicle would take such a hit that it might not be able to drive again. We've all gotten used to driving recklessly in GTA games, speeding through traffic, and killing a bunch of civilians on our way to the next destination, and having absolutely no regard for the rules of the road. Now if that were to change, we wouldn't even make it to the next mission without having to swap a dozen cars along the way. So yeah, sure, realism is cool and all, but sometimes it's okay to sacrifice a bit of reality for the sake of fun. And what about the computational power required to run a game with such realistic physics? Beam NG's car crashes are intense, but imagine trying to process that level of